Hello, welcome back to the Mr. Mocha channel. I'm Mr. Mocha aka Connor, and today we're just continuing Final Fantasy VI, and we're about to head to my favorite, my my most favoriteest part of the game. Um, oh, whoops, gotta go to the actual emulator. Okay, here we go. Let's just let's just get into it, man. I'm so excited. Cause I sucks that I went the wrong way, and honestly, I'm just gonna actually. I kind of wanna wait. Did, okay, wait. What magic did everyone learn? I kind of forgot. <laughs> I took a little break in between recordings. This is the same day. I'm um, all right. Yeah, that bolt's still good. Uh, you're still learning fire and all those. I'm seeing if I want to grab a chocobo or not. Actually, didn't you get Kieran? I can just see. You got Kieran and a dot, but you already had those two. All right, we're close to scan, so that's good. And stray. Oh, you're close to muddle. That's good. All right. Uh, I could just check. Like, I can go like to you and just check your uh, Ramoon. Okay. Cool. All right. So I'll, I'll walk there. Try to get some some more experience points and all that. Cause this is still an RPG. It's still a video game, not just the great story. But I j legitimately do like. Maybe it's just like the like. I think it's just a just like a thing in a lot of people that like RPGs. Just we like seeing the the numbers go higher. And I think that's the same thing with, uh, with me, is I just like, I just like seeing that progression, right? Like, I don't know, it's just that certain, like, gameplay, I, I like seeing, I like the turn-based system. I really like the active, I really wish they would bring back the active time battle system, man. I, it's like my favorite one. I don't know. Well, I also like the turn-based system of the earlier games. I don't know, it's a, I love these games. Even, like, the bad ones, like Final Fantasy VIII, I still find just so much enjoyment in. One, one, two. Capture. Fight. Fight. Oh yeah, fire dance. Oh wait, crap. Whoops, I thought you were doing fire dance. I'm dumb. That's fine. This is fine. Got him. Ha. Blitz. One, one, two, three, one. But, uh... <laughs> Last of us, the last couple episodes should. I just finished editing a few of the episodes. Last of us should be going up uh, in a couple days from this recording session. So, go check that out. That's my. Oh, oh, oh. Kill him with fire, please. When did you, what I did you wish but I wish did you but I What Did I get any Okay Use that on you Hold on <laughs> What the What the heck just happened? Do I gotta go back to Judor? I gotta go back to Judor and, and heal. I gotta save. Hold on. Whoa. That's never happened to me before. What the heck? I'm gonna. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Uh. Okay. Um. I'm gonna just uh, go back to Judor real quick and give me a chocobo and. Oh shit. Oh, uh, we're just gonna run. I'm not. Nah. We're just gonna try and get away. And it was a back attack. I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Uh -uh. Oh, give me. Eh. Oh god. Oh crap. This is fine. This is fine. This is this is fine. This is this is fine. This is okay. This is this is great. This is fine. This is. Oh god. This is. This is, um... At least Saban was like, You can't defeat me! Instant rage! Well, they, like, just killed him. Like, he, like, threw a bunch of stones and crap. Lived with enough HP. Like, was super confused, so he hit himself. Knocked out of confusion. And then freaking just... 
uppercutted and just smashed that guy's head in like the awesome mad lad he is, alright? That, that's what went through my head. Was it that epic on the screen? Probably not. Was it, uh, was it that epic in your head? No. But, you know, in my head, that was awesome. I'm gonna get a chocobo. Because I have enough money, right? Oh, yeah, most definitely. Honestly, I have enough money to go get some stuff. But, really, I, I'm good, so... GP? Yeah, sure. Because I'll just, I'll just go south. Yeah, we're gonna go this way. Alright, let's go to the opera house. That reminds me of like the the guys in the, the top hats would like clack around like tap dance with like the canes and stuff is what this reminds me of. Ah, let's do it again. I'm gonna make a of it like this. <laughs> I read that- I read that letter. Setzer's coming to steal her? He will probably appear right at the climax. <laughs> oh, you'll probably- oh, hold on. <clears throat> he'll probably appear right at the climax, eh? Hey, hey! Scene one, he loves his entrance, eh? Hey. Right. Right. If- oh, if we could only grab him then... Dear me, no. You'll ruin the performance, eh? Hey. I'll lose my job, you know what I'm saying? And his voice just changed again. Wow, that was... I'm sorry for any Italian slash French slash, uh... uh every national, uh, ethnicity. Anywho. Then your history. This is simply horrid. This is simply horrid. <clears throat> this is simply horrid. <laughs> I want the performance to be a success. <clears throat> he is not French. <clears throat> but I don't want the Maria <clears throat> to be abducted. <clears throat> Then Celis will be Maria. Oh, wait a minute. We'll let him- we'll let him grab her. Huh? We'll use Celis as a decoy. After she's abducted, I'll follow him right to his airship. Oh yeah, I'm so cool, I'm Locke. Oh, and Edgar and Saban can come along too, I guess. Are you mad? If something should happen to Maria... That's the voice, Maria! Maria. That's why the dec that's why the decoy will hide Maria somewhere safe. Come again. Come again. You said she looks like Maria, right? Oh uh, wait, uh, what what? Now just a minute. So this will be our Maria. And she'll lead us to the airship. Brilliante! I know that's not how you say brilliant France or any name, but I, I think that, that, yeah, okay. Wait, I'm a general, not some opera floozy. Ah, oh, crap. Door was locked. Uh, well, funny moment. Uh, that's where the laugh track goes in. Me, me, do, re, mi, va. Oh, those ears are smoking, I do me any good. <laughs> Maria. <laughs> anyway, all right, it's gonna be a little quieter. Not bad, Celis. I'll pretend to be Setzer and foil their little plan. Ultras, just, just what? Why? Let's get ready, Celis. It's showtime. We're all gonna go in the room and watch you change. <laughs> To see what's uh really under there, if you know what I'm saying. Well, I'm not really into kind of games, but it's good. Oh, thanks. Oh, oh, thanks. Okay, thanks. Okay, thanks. Thanks. Okay, thanks. Lord. Sorry, I thought that's the last one. Okay, sorry, that's okay. Sorry, that's the last one. Sorry, sorry, I had to take that text. My bad. Uh,. I was too not texting some people things. You know what I'm saying? But 
That's nothing. That's nothing. Uh, I would say go follow my Instagram, but I don't want anybody following my Instagram because, uh, you know, um, that's a personal kind of deal. And I'm not ready for that yet. But, anywho. So, uh, da -ha, come on, read it. This is my favorite scene in the entire game because it sets up why Celse is one of, if not the best character in the entire game. I'm about to show you all why she is my favorite character in fiction. Yeah, so all my friends that think that like Obi-Wan Kenobi or like Anakin Skywalker or Darth Vader or some shit is my favorite character, they're up there. But Celis is my favorite character in all of fiction. Is that the same, is that the Impressio or is that is the same day? Uh, I don't remember her lines. I'm gonna have to write those. I'm gonna have to write those down. I'll I'll probably remember when I see them, but I'm still gonna write them down because I just have some notes for Final Fantasy VI just in case. If I do ever like you know forget anything, I know I just take some notes. I thought about them doing some like review episodes, but honestly, unless it's for the Kingdom Hearts stuff, I don't think I'll do something like that. The West and the East were always waging war. Draco, the West's greatest hero. Yeah. Thinks of his love, Maria. <laughs> Anywho. Is she safe? Is she waiting? Whoa, Chickabuzz! Not Draco! No! It is supposed to be an opera, okay? But when uh, Celis actually starts singing, it's a beautiful song. I'd look up the actual, like, someone actually singing the opera version, it's beautiful. One of my, this is my favorite track in the whole entire game. I can't sing for shit, but... Dun, 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 dun. I'm going to the dressing room. Is everything okay? Is everything okay? <laughs> huh? Why is everyone singing? <laughs> okay, that's hilarious. Say, please turn around. Oh, it's in the other way. Whoops, my bad. How about we just? I just go this way, up around, this way, this way, up there. Perfect. Oh, oh shit. There we go. Oh, maybe not. God, where's those two again? Oh, was it down this way? It might have been down this way. It might have actually been right the first time. Yeah, I was right. Damn it. I always do that. This game has amazing music. Anywho. Oh, shit. Oh, crap. That's hot. <clears throat> Anywho. Uh, 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 oh, hey. Uh, hey. Yes. Hey. Sellers. Whoa. Hey. <laughs> Mark, why did you help me escape back there? I once abandoned someone when she was needed me. Somewhere inside you, you were saving her, weren't you? He just looks behind her. That ribbon suits you. Oh, on with the show. There's the big scene in which Maria senses that happened to Draco. You better check the score one last time. Read the score, yes. Scene one. 
Oh, my hero, so far away will I ever see you smile. Love goes... I'm gonna write this down. I'm gonna write this down. Hold on, wait a minute. I'm writing this down. Oh. My hero. So far. Away. Now. This sets up the later... This, I'm telling you guys. This sets up the later portion of the game. So that's why I'm writing it down as a note, right? Will I ever see your smile? And for some reason, this game gets criticized for this scene in particular because it's like, oh, well, they're halting. It has nothing to do with the real game's plot. And it's just halting the entire game to do this one little gimmicky opera scene. Well, I can kind of get the gimmick, like the gimmicky part. Yeah, it's a gimmick the opera scene, but... Do they not understand how much character this is going to develop? If Okay, so we just hear right, this, right? This doesn't really make sense unless you have later in the game, though. Uh, I'll, I'll explain. That's why I'm writing this down, right? Because I'm going to explain to you guys why this is this is so good foreshadowing in a song that you're not going to think two seconds of because it's a song. But it's such good setting up the story. This game uses its soundtrack to prepare, to to elevate like normally the games like normally game soundtracks are just there to uh for you to be able to like you know that was like a nice soundtrack like a nice battle theme when you're battling to feel epic you know this game uses its soundtrack so well that it uses it to um up its story and it's really nice um smile love goes i this is my favorite scene love goes away like night and today it's just a fading dream that is my favorite part goes away Like night into day, it's just a fading dream. Ah, oh, so good. In the darkness, you're the stars. Our love is brighter than the sun. For eternity, for me, there can be. Oh, is it? I'm the darkness. I'm the the I'm the oh crap we're guiding the Kingdom Hearts territory the darkness <laughs> crap we gotta go get Don Sora Donald Goofy in that order your your the stars our love our love is brighter than the sun for eternity for me there can be I'm assuming it's only one right only you okay only one would have been I think fit better but only you makes sense ah oh, it's such good foreshadowing i don't want to spoil it to the audience i've already spoiled some things for later in the game but i don't want to spoil this because when i first saw this i was like holy shit the lyrics to the song makes so much sense it's not just so it's the sound nice that makes it's like foreshadow oh that's so good that's this freaking game what how is this how is it doing what i, I, I just I don't, this video is gonna go on longer because i want to do the opera scene i think actually wait well, how long am i recording for uh i want to do the opera scene this this battle but i need to write this down for notes i could go back to it but i don't i don't want to i want to do this with you guys so i can explain the le oh, the lyrics are so good <laughs> only you only you my chosen one must I forget you? Our solemn promise will art art take the place of spring this video might be a little longer 
What shall I do? I'm lost with all these. Speak to me once more. Oh, it's so good. It's so good, guys. Shall I do? I'm lost without you. Speak to me once more. Here, you pick up the flowers, climb to the stairs to the balcony atop of the tower, raise the flowers to the stars. Hurry up, you just have moments before the scene two starts, the impressio. Scene two. Okay. Speak to me once more. Okay, I have that entire thing written down. I'm calling this, and you guys will see that the opera scene we're about to do in in the game soundtrack is Celis's theme. And it's so freaking good, guys. I love this game. I love this game so much. This is my favorite song in the game, by the way. I know, like, I keep saying there's so many good songs. The Forts of the West fell, and Maria's castle was taken. Prince Rouse of the East took her hand by force, but she never stopped yearning for Draco. Oh, my hero. Oh, Love goes away like night into day is just a fading dream. Ah, uh, no. Shit. Whoops. I meant to click down. Something wrong, eh? Oops, sorry. We'll be fine. Sorry, but yesterday's performance was awful. <laughs> okay, hold on. Go through that again. My bad. That was just me misclicking. Uh, okay. Honestly, we do this thing some Oh, my hero. Let me keep my hand on this. Shit, this might be my favorite game. Final, this might be Final Fantasy IX. Shit. Oh crap, it's a g g ghost! Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I had to break the tension there. <coughs> um, mm, hey you. Oh shit, I gotta go. Come, Maria, follow my lead. This song is so good. <laughs> and flowers. You pick up the flowers. You walk to the second floor balcony. You stand on this ledge. Remember this. Remember this scene right here. 
It's so good. You see, that's the great thing is she's talking about Locke here. She's saying basically the song's right now in the context of what we've played, right? The song is basically saying, "Do I mean as much to you as you mean to me?" Because Celis has the hots for Locke. The game doesn't make the game so gently you touch my heart. The game like no one's cared for Celis like Locke has in this game, right? So, because she was she was born to be a military leader. So everyone's always treated her as such. She was never given, except for maybe Sid, but that's later in the game. From what we've played in the game, this is actually directly the lock. I won't age a day, come may, what may, I'll wait for you always. That's that's about Rachel. She's saying that she'll do the same for Locke. She'll wait for Locke. That's so good. Prince Rouse is looking for a dance partner. Leave the past behind. Our kingdom is adopting the spirit of the East. So good. So fucking good, man. That's so good. But that's where we're going to leave off today's episode. That being said, I'm Mr. Mocha, aka Connor. That was the best scene in all of fiction. I think it, this game might take my top spot for best game of all time. But until next time, make sure to like and subscribe, and uh, go check out my friend Grace's channel. She'll be posting some videos in the next coming weeks, so uh, go check her out. She's the blue notebook. At least go subscribe to her. And uh, until next time, that's all, folks.